Hello there and um, welcome back to the uh, Big Fat Psychic channel and of course again we've got lots to discuss. Well hello guys, uh, welcome back, another long awaited uh, video. Um, I've been busy this week, uh, I have got some videos but you know again I like to come from a place where nobody else is coming from so it takes some thinking about. So anyway uh, in this video it's all about is Megan lying to Harry. I mean, we know she lies and uh, exaggerates uh, to everybody else. So I'm going to be interested, you know, to, I want to know what she lies about because we all do lie, you know. Oh, do you think my bum looks big? No. Oh, do you like what I'm wearing? Do you like my haircut? Yeah, lovely. Even when it's not. Um, what do I lie to my husband about? Oh, God, yes. The price of everything. Well, I always tend to knock about 70% off because, uh, you know, he doesn't know. He, he doesn't go shopping or buying anything. Yeah, what, what he doesn't know, doesn't it? Um, so I'm sure we all do uh, tell the odd parquet here and there. So, uh, right, let's start then. Okay, so I'm going to uh, just shuffle the cards again. And I've already done this, but let's have a look. Ooh, oh, okay. What lie is Megan telling about Archie? Come on, Anna. But these are all about lies, so let's have a look, okay? Whoa. Well, <laughs> I don't know whether it's telling me or her, but it's saying, you know, it's pointless bloody asking, really. Save, save your energy. Um, so... It's like pointless battle, so maybe she's been doing uh, stuff pointless. So, you know, all about this surrogacy. Well, uh, once she, you know, let's just say uh, Lady whatever her name is. What's that name? Lady whatever. Lady Gaga? No. Lady, lady, lady. She's got the long blonde hair. She's, you know, honestly, I watch her. I can't, remember, can't think now. But anyway, um, Lady Chatterley? Chatterley? Mm. Uh, so yeah, uh, pointless battles, if she's lying, yeah, but the, the things she's lying about seem to be uh, pointless and she's saving her energy, so what's she doing, she's saving her energy, so she's not, she's not talking uh, much about Archie, is she, apart from, I mean, we all hear that son so I saw him and this, that and the other, but we haven't seen him, you know, um, and I've always said Archie does uh, exist, um, but you know, with Archie, uh, she feels that she's been uh, criticised uh, a, a lot. Um, she feels uh, that she, where he's concerned, she feels a uh, pressure uh, to show him. So she's making excuses, really. She's making excuses, um, and what else she's doing? She's pressure she's defensive uh she, she but she's arguing the point why should i defend myself you know why should i uh respond why should i you know so um yeah in a whiny little voice uh so yeah she's the little it's pointless little lies i mean that's what we're seeing into when they're on the screen and oh she's walking now oh you know for all i know they could be talking about a bloody dog you know there's nothing actually uh personal not uh oh he said mama today or oh he says grandma for elizabeth you know so uh yeah just pointless okay uh but you know it will come out about that actually okay okay uh so did uh has megan told lies about harry's friends you know so has she been like oh tom upset me if he didn't like me so it was awful to me you know it was um was she you know engineering because we know how jealous she is. She doesn't like anybody to have an influence. Anybody that has an outside influence is a direct threat to her. Okay, so um, has she lied uh, about Harry's friends? And I'm going to go with me dragon card. Oh, okay. So it uh, might be up to all that dragon card look, yeah. Uh, there's my dragon breathing fire from the sun. The sun's shining down and 
you know, everything's, uh, oh, it's just beautiful. And then you've got all your sun seed flowers, sunflowers, yeah. Um, so, unfortunately, the for her, it's upside down. So, she's upset. Uh, oh, she made out uh, that they didn't make her happy. She wasn't happy with the friends. She wasn't happy with the uh, the bonds. And, you know, I mean, some of these, uh, Harry and his mates have been together since being little kids. And she didn't like that, you know, because uh, obviously they're like family. And, uh, you know, they trust her because they are being funny. I suppose my friends, too, uh, know a hell of a lot me about me and how, you know, how my feelings are or what have you uh, than my parents do. Um, and I'm 45 and I'll, I'll willingly say that. Uh, so, you know, if I was in a bad relationship and my friends was uh, giving me advice or, you know, pointing, they don't, they would never tell me what to do, but they in their own way, they, they would, you know, they would talk to me and give me advice. So uh, that's what she didn't uh, like. And she doesn't want their, because, uh, Harry wanted him and his mate, is it, to to have the children playing together? No. Megan's not having that. Megan's not having that, you know. So, uh, you know, we are, she has isolated him. Um, and I think as well, um, one of the guys uh, is or was in the area or is going to see Harry and she's not happy about any of his friends coming, even to the States, you know, there could be in another bloody... Uh, town but she's not happy and I'm trying to make excuses to find why these people cannot your friends are not coming to my house they don't like me and I don't like them you know well they don't like him again because they see uh, they actually see a hell of a lot more than we do um so and you know harry's a type as well in it that i'll just go whinging you know feel sorry for me uh you know oh she nags me oh we're not having sex anymore oh she's always tired oh she's always grumpy you know uh so yeah just uh she's not happy um about his friends and so we know that don't we and with the son so we've got I don't know why people say the sun in Spain is different to the sun in the UK, but anyway, that I'm going to say it myself now. Uh, yeah, so you've got the sun here and the sun there, uh, and she's keeping him on the other side of the sun. So, you know, she's keeping the distance um, and she'll be using uh, the, the corona uh, virus as an excuse at the moment, you know. Um, oh, you know, so uh, it doesn't surprise me that she doesn't want him uh, actually to mingle with other children uh, of his friends because she won't even allow him to play with the cousins while she in the UK. So, which is, uh, you know, I can't believe, you know, Megan, go and do what if you like to yourself and to Harry and to the royal family even. But do you know psychologically how much damage you have done to your child already already and all in the name of money all in the name of gold i just can't believe that you know i, I mean I, I would never ever be uh you know a top exec say uh, apple because i'm not ruth ruthless enough i'm not uh i'm calm i'll probably give it you know away but uh yeah i'm not ruthless enough um i'm not cold enough you know i mean I suppose really quite most successful people have that ruthless streak in them don't they well i don't i don't so and i'm quite happy with that you know i think if i was if i was uh meant to be that way then i would be wouldn't i but i've been shaped a a, a different way so uh yeah no so the friends oops yeah 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 Okay, um, so let's have a look then. So line number eight. <laughs> what is Megan, right? Because we've had this uh, bizarre PR, you know, we know everything. Uh, so Frogmore, uh, what was it? The, oh, finding freedom. Well, you know, we'll do another uh, video on that. I've got them all lined up for you. But uh, yeah, so, you know, what is Megan lying about now? About the uh, upcoming court case? Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> I'm loving it. More drama to come. And it's in less than a month, so mark my words, she's on knife's edge. On knife's edge. So you've got the Ace of Swords uh, reverse. So any good arguments, uh, you know, she can't argue uh, that. Uh, about a privacy case, you know, if she's giving out information left, right and centre, um, she's had to uh, do this no doubt because of uh, the five friends now become one friend, uh, you know, because rightly so, I would refuse, you know, I would absolutely refuse um, if it was a lie, you know, it, people haven't got a problem uh, telling the truth in court. But when you know you're lying, oh my God, they're not going to perjure themselves or, you know, or even just get, you know, a lashing from the uh, the press about it. Nobody's going to put themselves in that situation for, for her. And I can't even see the benefits, actually. I just can't. So, um, yeah, she's uh, she's lying. She's feeling on a nice edge about it. There's more stuff coming out. Uh, there's delays. Oh, oh my God, there's more problems. And she's going to find, when you stick the knife in, okay, when you stick the knife in, Megan, be careful because as you twist it and turn it, it's difficult to pull that knife back out and leave a clean cut. Uh, so, you know, that, that's a metaphor. That's a metaphor. All right. Uh, so, yeah. Um, so, yeah, she's, uh, she's put her oar in uh, and now... She, when she's extracting, everything's going to get zigzagged all over because and cut and split and, uh, you know, spilt because she, um, she can't backtrack just like that, you know. She cannot backtrack, but Megan, darling, you're starting to lose uh, credibility. And I even hear your sugars uh, are going uh, quiet as well, you know, so keep going because... You know, like I say, America's waking up to her just as the UK has already done. You are, you know, so annoying, honestly. So annoying. So, uh, yeah, she's a... Uh, oh, more problems. So, you know, this is to... Oh, uh, it's uh, to do with writing. Writing. It's uh, communication, uh, the mind, the thoughts. Ooh, ah, 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 ah. Is it? Is it the phone? Is it the text messages? I bet it is. Uh, because there's not just one thing on there, is it? I mean, if you look on my phone, my husband deletes his text messages uh, as soon as they come in. But I don't. Man, man I've got like three, four years worth uh, of them. I just, you know, I just keep them. So, um, and yeah, it's true. She can change the contact name and make it look like it went to Thomas Michael. But all you have to do is click on that contact and just uh, view that telephone number to see if it matches Thomas's. Uh, and I bet it doesn't. I bet it doesn't because she wasn't thinking uh, clearly. She was reacting. And when you react to something, uh, you you know, you make mistakes. If you pre-plan and you're organised, uh, then, you know, about a dad not coming or a planned argument or a reason, giving him a reason he couldn't come or, you know. Um, so, yeah, uh, she was reacting at that moment. And, of course, she's hot-headed and she wouldn't have uh, realised that, you know, all the text messages can be brought. Uh, brought up uh without her having to submit them basically you know so everything is not private on your phones and we all know that don't we every stroke of the keyboard every stroke of the um the the character on your phone you know it's all it's all there somewhere it is all there somewhere you know big brother is watching us uh so yeah she she's um Ooh, 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 and more is coming out, and don't, don't forget, uh, don't forget, don't forget. Didn't we have that uh, big bill coming our way? Uh, a, a big demand for a lot of money uh, around this month, we said. So, uh, yeah, I think it's the 21st today, so we've still got another 10 days uh, to see this. And, you know, as we've always with these two, uh, there will be more headlines to come. Okay, so uh, Frogma. <laughs> Frogma. Well, I've got another video on Frogma, but anyway, so I'll just ask the, the question. Okay, what the hell happened with Frogma? What the hell happened with Frogma? I'm going to go for a dragon card. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, a judgment. <gasps> judgment, so they've been told, you know, uh, get your act together, do this, that, and the other. Uh, you can be seen uh, to be doing something nice. 
no, Megan, that's not the truth, is it? You've been pushing your trumpet too far, mouthing off, and now you're getting it. You're getting it, you know. That uh, that Frogmore place was a uh, gifted to you, but only while you live in the premises, because, of course, it's not theirs to build, knock down or anything, you know. It be it belongs to uh, the UK taxpayer, actually. The Queen just lives there. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. You've been shouting your, your mouth off, going too far, flying in the air, you know. Uh, and now you're being called uh, to be accountable. And also, as well, I mean, it will be in the other video, but, you know, these two never do not for not, okay? So, judgment's been made, uh, and also they need to uh, offset costs because uh, that Frogmore is costing them money still. Well, actually, it's costing us, but, uh, yeah, it is costing them as well. So, um, they are off, you know, they are offsetting it. It's a way of... Uh, getting extra money but please ain't trying to please everybody and save face so uh no megan it wasn't your choice at all you know but as you go you're blowing your own trumpet again uh you know it was us we're generous well it just doesn't make sense because fragmar wasn't yours to give away it's never been yours to give away and it's never been yours it was you to stay there not to bloody give away the only person who can do that is the queen so uh this is bollocks you know but like megan and harry do they've cottoned on to the fact that they can say whatever they like whatever they like because guess what the the palace ain't gonna come back and deny 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 are they i mean i thought that was really really clever about that bloody uh intellectual piece uh of uh the letter to a father okay uh so you know it just goes to show that they are his gloves off now it's like tit for tat william is strongly in the line of addition out uh you know cut their comeuppance and it is about time it is about time and i just want people uh to see to see what we see you know to see what i mean anybody who treats the family like that not just their family but the royal family her children her staff her friends you know uh, the people she works with Oh my God, this woman is just a, a, a nightmare. She is an absolute borderline, pal what is it? Borderline personality disorder uh, mess. She's a, you know, honest to God, she really is. Um, and the thing is, well, I hope somebody's telling her because she needs a bit of therapy and, uh, with BPD, is it? You just can't take tablets. It can't be about that. It's about, uh, you know, it's about been kind of split i suppose you know at a certain age uh there would have been it's mainly to do with uh trauma but i can't imagine what her trauma was uh but yeah she's oh no she's just i don't know i don't understand her to be fair i could do a, a reading right into her but i don't want i don't want to know i don't want to know her pathetic excuses uh for uh, for being horrible to other people you know so if before I'm horrible to somebody like my mum, <laughs> I think I would I feel if it you know if it was that way uh, to me. Um, now my mum's given me plenty of practice over the years, but uh, yeah. So no, she's. Uh, but I'm fine with everybody else, you know. I suppose we all have uh, one person that can tick us off and send us over. But like with Megan, everybody sends her over, you know. Everybody sends her over. So yeah. Um, Mm, blowing your own trumpet lover well you're being judged for it and uh, now it's time to start paying the price okay so uh oh from that that was from that okay all right line number 10 has uh megan has megan lied about loving harry has megan lied about mm, thinking loving harry Knight of Pentacles, upside down. Oh, am I a word? Right, okay, so, uh, no, she she has lied because there's another man around her uh, and it's all about making money, you know, getting a bit of this, getting a bit of that. Uh, I wouldn't trust him as far as I could throw him. Uh, she is, uh, 
Yeah, I mean, I'm seeing a knight upside down, so a male upside down. Um, you know, I'm going to say as well, though, you know, I have to say it because sometimes I keep myself if I don't and I see it on camera and then I realise, you know, what I was really on about. Uh, I'm going to say um, about a man as well. He's, he's uh, lying. I think Harry's lying. I really do. That's really, really odd. And uh, she, you know, it's as if she's uh, she's sticking her neck out for him. She's like doing a favour. I don't know if you can see my little dragon there. Uh, sticking that, you know, not breathing any fire. But oh, let's have a look. I've got like a genie, a genie, a genie. Do I mean a genie? Yes, I do mean a genie because it's like a rubbing the uh, magic light. You know, what 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 do you wish for? Uh, what do you wish for? You know, um, so uh, yeah, it's a bit of trickery there. Bit of trickery. Um, but then I can see a couple of other. Uh, oh no, they're legs, aren't they? Are they legs? Yeah, they're legs. Yeah, definitely uh, something missed there. So where it's in, um, hair love for Harry, I'm getting a meal that's not to be trusted. So, uh, all about the money. But this is like not working hard for it. It's uh, about, you know, trying to get away as doing least physical work as uh, you can. So, um, that should, they both love money. They both love money, you know. So, hell of a Harry. He didn't actually say, did it? You know, it's saying he's not to be trusted. So maybe they're not in love. You know, maybe it's true, and uh, you know, he's living this other altered ego uh, life, another life uh, that we don't know about. But um, I, I'm not sure there. I'm not sure there, because if he was gay, then once it. That would uh, really mess up about Archie. Because, it, I mean, all right, is he bisexual? That could be it, you know, look at, look at, look at. But I don't know, you know. Uh, she's not, she probably didn't trust him. How strange. You know, that'll come back to bite me, that one, because I'll, uh, I'll be, I'll see it. It'll, something will come out and I think, God, that's what it meant. That's what it meant. But yeah, anyway, so apparently um, she's seen he's, that he's not to, to be trusted. Oh, well, okay then. Uh, right then. Um, right, light 11. What are, uh, what are Megan's uh, true intentions towards the royal family and Harry, you know, as a, a group? I'm not really confused now. Okay, so uh, I try not to go careful, uh, to go silent for too long. So, all right, we're getting the negative side of uh, trickery. So we're not actually seeing what we should be seeing. So uh, they're putting it, uh, one thing in front of us. So like they're together, uh, and that she's still part of the royal family, when maybe she's not, and she's uh, elsewhere um her true intentions she is uh using others um as well to you know so i don't know she's using others so uh, could she be using uh, others with advice like the clintons or uh the obamas or uh what's her name oprah oprah um and all all, all those kind of people so uh basically uh there are no intentions because uh the only intentions she's got is not uh walking away not having things come out um i'm not seeing her with the tools uh to to make a success of trying to ruin uh the royal family okay because the the people are becoming more and more away i mean the more you slight somebody you know the more uh victim and innocent they look you know because of all the negativity so uh her true intentions at the moment is uh she's not going to act right now um she's been very very careful uh around them um that so she is uh giving the sleight of hand so you know while you're looking at that thing you know hand this hand's doing something else um you know she's just gonna continue um 
she's going to continue what we've been saying about other lies earlier. You know, she's going to continue throwing things out there, um, knowing that they're our family and not going to get into a tiz about it, you know. Uh, so she thinks she can uh, get the way. You know, she's just like, all this is teaching her is the negative side. She never sees the positive side, you know, uh, about these things. I mean, no, she, she's seeing always how to um get something out of this uh you know so yeah uh, again making out things are happening when they're not or trying to uh you know just more 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 games really more fun and bloody games with these two uh but mainly her she's the game player um so yeah uh throwing tensions for harry and the royal family she's hoodwinking them she's hoodwinking them so she has got a plan she has got a plan it's a major plan uh but right now she's not going to act uh so you know what's this plan then what is this plan oh don't tell me it's to get rid of him and go into politics because um in order for that prediction that i made to come true uh trump has to lose and i'm i'm gutted really um I, and I worry uh, for for the world as as things stand. Um, yes, he's uh, he's certainly something, but you know, he's a billionaire already. Before he went into uh, president, you know, and he was sorting out uh, stuff. He was very firm and very tough, you know, and he was leading the way out. So yeah, just uh, worrying uh, about that. So she's in that inch. She? She's in that in group. Um, and funnily enough, she hasn't been saying anything. So, you know, I don't know. Quite a few of her uh, psychics and skeptics, they're all saying that there is voter fraud. But all I can say is that when I, uh, when I asked whether he would, uh, you know, win the election, it said no. In fact, it was the nine of cups reverse. So, you know, not not being happy and not getting your wishes uh, at, at that time. So hopefully, you just never know. But I don't know. I'm really confused because I did say that, but then an earlier reading, um, when we was talking about Megan for for president, I did say I thought it'd be all right. So um, I'm probably highlighting a failure there, but no, I, I, it will all become clear. Um, you know, so maybe the nine of cups reversed at that time was you know what he was going to show rather than um, what comes later. So you know, hopefully. Uh, he'll stay in I don't think so to be fair because this is where Megan's journey uh, politically uh, starts to pick up she's being groomed now um, you know for bigger and better things so if she wants to be uh, go for president in a few years she's going to win she's going to get rid of Harry and you know I don't know I, I just don't think two negative people it's like two drunks can't be in the same relationship because it's never ever going to work um so you know and and they're kind of toxic two toxic people uh it's just not going to work it is not going to work one has to give and one takes and we all know uh <laughs> we all know Megan takes now it's a uh, debate about what whether Harry is the giver or the taker if you know what I mean okay so i'm um, right let's have a look um okay is megan lying about being with harry okay is she lying about being in a you know a marriage a loving relationship with harry is she lying so are they together uh, they are because of a young child okay so uh that's that's what's been shown it's always do you know the page on any of us readers tends to be about uh harry so um right are they together uh well i do see that they have a child together archie as we know but are they together well i'm not actually quite sure here because i'm getting information i'm getting writing so um i'm seeing uh like texting texting each other i don't know why i'm seeing that but i'm seeing texting so you know oh what i mean i know in my house my son's in the loft and i'm in the uh, downstairs so there's like three levels and uh i have to text him to come down for his tea because no matter how hard i bloody shout up them stairs you know he, he doesn't hear me but yeah he'll see uh, a flash up on uh, the text so quite the same really so um i'm gonna see uh you know there's uh messages here so are they together 
uh, I think they're around for the sake of the the child um but he's going off to uh do things because i'm seeing uh police army and navy these are my cards you know for training and uh, so it's funny that we should mention the, the army there um so he's probably uh going to be doing something with the army and maybe he's spending more time uh away um they're together you know financially uh they've got good news coming um there's hard you know oh uh hard work there i'm not sure where this bloody hard work's coming from but hard work uh, uh, getting our attention yes maybe um so uh, a new work new work for them so um are they together yes but no i'm seeing uh you know i'm maybe seeing why am i doing that so can you see me yeah they're, they're away somebody's away okay somebody's away um hmm. archie 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 and then they're saying somebody's away so let's have a look let's have a look as an arrival responsible dropping out <laughs> I'm saying there's going to be an offer here regarding some money, an offer of money. Okay, so uh, let's see, let's see. But she's definitely been offered uh, money, you know. So she was lying um, about. So I don't think uh, she's lying about being with Harry. I really do, and I don't, I'm I'm not sure why I'm getting that because I've always had that he loves her. You know, I've always had that he loves her. So, but you know, I can just see it right now, and I can't stop doing it. They they're not together. They're not together at the moment. Oh, okay, okay. So, um, right. Uh, I hope you've uh, enjoyed this reading. Uh, thank you for staying with me to the end. And um, well, have a great day. Have a great week. Uh, I'll be back soon. Bye now. Bye bye.